Hey guys, welcome back to The Walking Dead. In the last episode, Kenny uh, shot a kid zombie that was starved to death. Or he had starved to death and he turned into a zombie. I was burying him and some guy was watching me. Now we're about to head out down to the river and Ben is complaining more about how I don't trust him because he's a piece of trash. That's not how it is, Ben. I need you to stay here. Yeah, actually, it is how it is. I just didn't have enough time I to can do think. That. Well, just so we're clear, while I'm gone, Anything or anyone tries to get inside this house, you shoot them. Don't even think twice about it. Understand? I got no problem shooting walkers. Did you hear what I said? Anything or anyone? Good. Yeah, Ben, I'm Ben, this is your last chance. The last chance you're getting from me. If you mess this up, sir, you're Dunskis. Dunskis. Infected. So they hang out. East Bay and Lincoln Street. Biohazard sign. Who hung all these up? I think Kenny's about ready to give up. I don't think he's got a reason to live anymore, really. I think that's the issue we're having here. Hey, uh, so you want to talk about it? About what? About what happened back there in the attic. No. You sure, man? I mean, River's we... right up ahead. Son of a bitch. That bastard's fucking with us again. It's another trap. No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. Don't shoot. Just let him go. What in the hell is going on? I think they're using a system of bells to lure the dead into certain parts of town so they can go to other places. I don't know, but the person ringing that bell might be doing us a favor. Whatever, man. I find whoever's doing that, I'll ring their motherfucking bell for them. Good one. <laughs> Witty. Hmm. Let's keep moving. But that crawling zombie is always late to the parties. Still nothing moving behind us. I think we're... No boats. There's got to be a boat. There's got to be. Are you sure about that? Doesn't look like it to me. Maybe we need to start thinking about a plan B. This is the plan. It's the only one we've got, and you pissing on it in front of everyone like you did back at the house ain't exactly helping. Well, screw you. I ain't giving up that easy. Me say anything about your plan is not going to make boats magically appear, sir. This one might still be salvageable. You better be right about this. I said it might be. Give me a fucking break. I'm a fishing captain, not a miracle worker. I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. See what you can find. Okay. <sighs> Good old Kenny. What, what's that? what are you looking at that for? What's up there? Boards? What are looking at boards for? A 
Seriously? Walk all the way over here to look at some boards? Like the whole city has been boarded up for all the good it did. Oh, that was awesome. Thanks. Something like this. I got the freaking Spartans out here. I made a wall of dead people. Fantastic. Shoot the walkers? <sighs> uh, that's stupid. Look at the markings. I've been seeing these. Yeah, these markings? They're all over the place. Yeah, I've been seeing them too. I think they're. Hmm. Somebody's setting up some good stuff around here. I have a feeling. Alright, let's just get to the telescope. Great. Needs a quarter to work. Oh wait, there's a cash register back there. Cash register. Hello, beautiful. Empty. Too easy. I just need a quarter. Quarter. <laughs> Someone already looted the place. Oh, they can go find a quarter at. Just one on the ground. Could be military tags, but what do they mean? Why does it want me to shoot that one? Using walkers like scarecrows. What sick bastard did this? Do I... Am I supposed to shoot him? I really don't think it's a good idea. i bash this thing. How about that? Damn. Built solid. Hmm. <laughs> Don't think I'm gonna see anything until I find a quarter. I don't know where to find one at, unless I'm supposed to shoot the zombie and it falls out. Kenny, do you have a quarter? You got a quarter on you? Don't have a lot of use for small change these days. Maybe you can find one on the street somewhere. Yeah, maybe. Quarter. Someone must have been trying to back their boat into the water. Only things didn't go as planned. Oh. Quarter in here. Bash that. Locked. Bash it. Yeah! Rich. Rich as heck. Anything else over here? Okay. We got ourselves a quota, so let's go put it in the machine and take a look. Fuck! What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. Hulls crack beneath the water line, plus someone stripped out the battery. You can't fix it? What the... what the hell is that? A fate worse than death. What? This is a barricade, sir. Okay, let's see what we can find out here. No way that one's salvageable. Nope. Nothing but water. Not a boat to be seen. The hell? Heck, the heck is going on here? Get down! Get down! It's a ninja person. 
Why the hell are we hiding? Someone came down from that building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that newsstand. Could be our bell ringer. How about we go find out? Sounds like a plan. Okay, you head up the middle of the street. I'll go around the side, cover your flank. We'll come up on him quiet, take him by surprise. We just want to talk to this guy. Oh, we're gonna talk. <laughs> All right. I'm coming for you, buddy. Oh, he's gonna... He knows I'm coming. Oh, god dang it. What the... Ooh, straight ninja. Ah! I clicked it! No! Clem? Please, don't hurt him! What are you doing here? You're not from Crawford. I don't know him. You're not the guy on the radio. I'm not a guy at all. Full marks for observation. Kenny, don't! He's with us! Girl, you're trying to stab everybody, aren't you? Who the hell are you people? I asked you first. The name's Molly. Molly? I'm Lee. This is Kenny and Clementine. We're not looking for any trouble. You guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? No, I'm from Macon. Kenny here's from Florida. She didn't ask for our life stories, Lee. What's the deal with this Crawford place? You sure you want to know? <sighs> when everything yeah, we we'll freaking want to know. Tell us, Jesus got Christ. Together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive, stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero-tolerance policy for anyone who won't, or can't, live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? Lily must be with them. Because there are no children in Crawford. Not anymore. Do you know who's been ringing those bells all over town? Yeah, that would be me. I knew it! Lee, I knew she was the one who'd been following us! Fucking with us! Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I jam it straight up your ass. I haven't been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people are. Calm down, Kenny. The voice on the radio was a guy, remember? Yeah, well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raise the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the area as they cleared out. Geeks? Is that what you call them? Yeah, you know, like at the carnival? They'll eat anything, alive or dead. That's pretty smart, the bells. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. You just gotta move fast, get in and out before they start to wander back again. Was that you at our house this morning? Watching me through the back fence? Hell no. Believe it or not, I've got better things to do with my time. I don't believe it. By the way, Clem, what, the are, you what are you doing here? Get out of the house. <clears throat> the meat started getting really sick. <clears throat> and Ben had to take him upstairs. I didn't just want to sit around there. I wanted to come help. I told you we didn't need any help. 
Yeah, she didn't save me, but geez, you walked really? all the way here. Because if it weren't for her showing up when she did, I would have beaten your brains out. That's debatable. Uh huh. Okay, why no children? What do you mean, no children? Why not? Because they kill them all, they just no waste children, the food, right? No elderly, no one with an advanced medical condition. Basically, no one who might be a burden on the community. Crawford's all about the survival of the fittest. That's how they survived. All the rest of the world went to shit around them. Jesus Christ. Well, just the opposite when you think about it. That's not how our group does things. You're not saying they actually... I mean, I mean kids? No, the children, they just forced to leave. Along with their parents. Left that's them to why, fend for themselves out here in the world. That's why the kid was alone. Why? Like I said, in the, zero in the attic. Crawford got rid of anyone that couldn't pitch in, pull their own weight. The way they looked at it, those people were just a lot of useless mouths to feed. So the, a drain on their precious The parents resources. were with the Crawfords, and they were forced to kick their kid out. Maybe that's why the guy was looking. I think, I think, I think it was him. Everyone in Savannah knew. What was going on inside Crawford got passed around like a ghost story. Except this one was true. Hmm. Now she's going to feel like a bird on the again. You're not from Crawford, so who the hell are you? What are you doing here? Came down here looking for a boat. Hoping to get our people out of here and find something safe. Yeah, good luck with that. Anyone with a boat took it out of here as soon as people started eating each other. Any that got left behind, Crawford stripped them for parts. Cars, too. There's gotta be something. If there was, do you think I'd still be here? I've been over every inch of this city. This whole place is picked clean. God damn it! Fuck! Hey, moron. You wanna keep your voice down? Since you're not getting on any boat, I'd advise you folks to go back to where you came from before. Great. Just great. All the zombies are here. Isn't that the, the way we came? Fuck. Gunshot must have brought him back. Isn't there another way back to the house? Mom, is there a. Is there another way out of here? Don't know, don't care. So what the hell are we supposed to do? I refer you to my previous answer. But you have to help us, please. <sighs> Come on, make it fast. All right. <clears throat> Quick. Hey guys. Come on. Come on, man. One good jump. I hope your side's not so busted. No. Oh. Jump over it. Hurry. Ah oh, man, well, that wouldn't work anyway. Get on top of it. Come on, Lee! Get your ass out of there! Ah, can't get it open! Here! Use that to pry it open! Okay. Uh, yeah. Ah! Screw you, zombie! Phew! Yeah! Zombies want me, but they can't have me. Ah. <laughs> That's what you get, stupid. Ah, your face. Your face. Clementine, can you hear me? If you can hear me, just get back to the house, okay? I'll meet you there. All right. Well. On a new adventure. We gotta go through the sewers. We found a girl I don't even like. Another person, a new, another new person I don't like. Um, how about that? Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed it, and thanks for watching. Stay toasty, my friends.